There are some cut and dried car insurance situations, like when you crash into a car that is stopped at a red light, you're responsible, your insurance will pay. And then there's some questions that are a little bit more sketchy, like if my car is damaged from road debris, who is responsible? Will insurance help me out? We're gonna get to that. We're gonna answer those questions, but before we get started, if you wanna save money on car insurance, head over to freeadvice.com. They have an auto insurance comparison tool and it's easy to compare rates and find the coverage you need, like coverage to cover damage from road debris. It makes it easy to find and helps you save money. It's free to use, so you might as well go on over and try out the tool and see how much you could save by switching insurance companies. Not everybody with insurance is going to have coverage for road debris. So what do you, what kind of coverage do you need to be covered in that situation? Um, it could vary. Road debris damage could be from a rock hitting your windshield. It could be because a tree fell down in a storm and you were maybe driving a little bit too fast and crashed into it. So what kind of coverage do you need? Well, I have this article here by Insurance Information Institute, iii.org, and it is explaining the surprising things that comprehensive coverage will cover. And it, here we see the last thing on their list is a broken windshield, and one of the reasons can be from a piece of gravel or road debris suddenly putting a ding in your vehicle's windshield. Comprehensive insurance will cover that. Some people even have windshield damage coverage kind of separate with no deductible. It's, it's included with comprehensive, but it's also kind of its own thing. Now, if you hit something, a bigger piece of road debris, like a tree that's fallen, that's going to be covered by collision coverage. Similar, something in the roadway that's not supposed to be there, but if you hit a tree, it's a little bit different than a piece of gravel hitting your windshield. And another maybe situation that you could consider is if a car, let's say a flatbed trailer has a stack of wood on it and they're driving down the road and it's not properly secured and that wood comes up and hits your car, dents your hood, maybe cracks your windshield. That driver that didn't secure their load is responsible, but sometimes that can be hard to get to the bottom of because of they will, might not know what happened and they continue driving. Meanwhile, you can't drive because you can't see out of your windshield and you just never catch up to them again. In that situation, you could use your comprehensive car insurance for that. Um, then we have, does my auto insurance cover road debris? Freeadvice.com can help us out with that. The answer is yes, if you have collision and comprehensive insurance. It says right here, um, auto insurance covers damage from road debris through collision and comprehensive car insurance coverage. Your liability car insurance is not going to do it for you. So if you only have the state minimum, you won't be covered. But if you have full coverage, you will be covered. So head on over to freeadvice.com. You can right here, compare quotes. The first thing on this page that talks about road debris is auto insurance. So if you were, but if you wanted to look up something else, you could click on this menu here and look at all these different types of insurance. Um, really, really convenient. And then here you're gonna put your zip code in and then get quotes. And it's gonna go through a, several different questions but you can find out how much it will cost to, if you only have liability coverage, you might be surprised by how, it's how affordable full coverage is. Um, over here, I wanna show you some rates for full coverage so that you can get an idea. Now the different color here is age groups. So the orange is for 16 year olds. And you can see they pay 
outrageous rates for full coverage. Then the blue is for 30 year olds. You can see that the price of premiums drops significantly. And then the gray is 40 year olds. And you can see that 40 year olds pay just a little bit less than 30 year olds. Because by the time you're 40, you have a, you've established a driving record and you're not taking as many risks and you're just driving safer, you're a lower risk to insurance companies, and so you pay lower premiums. But you can see how, how important it is to compare rates because if you're a 16 year old, country financial is gonna be half the cost of Liberty Mutual over here for your, for your rates and comparing is gonna alert you to that fact. Geico, one of the best insurers for teens. But anyway, those are, this just gives you an idea of what you may possibly be paying based on your age if you decide to get full coverage so that if you have a road debris incident, you are covered. Comprehensive and collision coverage, full coverage is what you're gonna need to cover you from road debris. So in this article here by USA Today, it explains that comprehensive coverage, here we're talking about comprehensive coverage, covers debris kicked up by another vehicle on the road. So some areas are notorious for, for example, people in Montana are far more likely to have their windshield broken by a rock getting kicked up than somebody on the East Coast. It's just the, the speed limits, the amount of traffic there is, just increases that risk. And so you're gonna wanna have comprehensive insurance if you want to have that covered. And then like I said before, if you want, if you're crashed into debris on the road, like larger debris, collision insurance is going to cover you. Now to find the best ways to save on full coverage, go to freeadvice.com, enter your zip code, your information. It's free, it's easy. You can compare rates, several rates all at once instead of entering your information for every individual company, which could take you all day. This is gonna save you a lot of time. You can find rates that are low enough. If you haven't compared rates for a while, you might even pay less for full coverage than what you're paying now for a lesser form of coverage. So if you want road debris covered, you're gonna need comprehensive and collision coverage, and then you're protected. Liability only, you will be responsible for your own damage.